Welcome to my channel flight's assistance. Airline news, Air Lingus issues, major A33 NEO updates and Virgin Atlantic developments, Air Lingus operational struggles, delayed recovery. Air Lingus has encountered challenges in its post-pandemic recovery. The airline has faced operational setbacks, including staffing issues and delays, which have impacted flight schedules and customer satisfaction. Fleet shortfalls. The airline's aging fleet has posed maintenance challenges, leading to unplanned aircraft groundings. The lack of new aircraft replacements has increased pressure on Aer Lingus, especially during peak travel periods. Competition with low-cost carriers. Aer Lingus competes with low-cost airlines like Ryanair on short-haul routes. As Ryanair expands, Aer Lingus has felt increased pressure to maintain competitive pricing, complicating profitability efforts. Expanding transatlantic network. Increased U.S. routes. Despite challenges, Aer Lingus is expanding transatlantic services, adding routes to destinations such as Cleveland, Ohio, and Hartford, Connecticut. This effort aims to establish a stronger U.S. footprint, especially with the increased demand for transatlantic flights. Dublin Hub Strategy Aer Lingus is positioning Dublin as a strategic hub for U.S. Europe travelers. With U.S. pre-clearance available, Dublin offers a convenient transit experience, enabling Aer Lingus to capture passengers who prefer this added convenience for connecting flights. Big news for the A330 Neo. Rising demand for fuel efficiency. The A330 Neo, with its more efficient engines and lower carbon emissions, is increasingly attractive to airlines focused on sustainability. Compared to earlier models, the A330 NEO delivers up to 25% better fuel efficiency, meeting stricter emission standards that many airlines prioritize today. Major orders from key airlines. Airbus recently secured major orders for the A303 NEO from airlines like Condor, Lufthansa, and Air Greenland. These deals underscore the model's growing popularity among airlines looking for wide-body options that offer flexibility and fuel savings. A330 NEO vs Boeing 787 The A330 NEO has emerged as a strong competitor to the Boeing 787, offering similar capabilities but often at a lower acquisition cost. As the 787 faces production delays, the A330 NEO has become a more reliable option for carriers eager to expand. Virgin Atlantic's expanding partnerships. Strengthening Sky Team Alliance membership. Virgin Atlantic's recent entry into the Sky Team Alliance allows it to tap into a broader network, giving passengers more choices and seamless connectivity across Sky Team's routes. This strategic move enhances Virgin's ability to compete with British Airways and other major transatlantic carriers. Growing Codeshare Agreements Virgin has signed codeshare agreements with Sky Team members, including Delta, Air France, and KLM, allowing Virgin Atlantic to increase its reach without expanding its own fleet. This partnership offers passengers more flexibility while allowing Virgin to offer a broader range of destinations. New Airbus A330 NEO deliveries. Virgin recently received new A330 NEO aircraft, part of an effort to modernize its fleet. These planes feature enhanced cabin layouts, improved fuel efficiency, and better in-flight entertainment options, elevating Virgin's service standards. Sustainability initiatives. Focus on carbon reduction. Both Virgin Atlantic and Aer Lingus are investing in greener technologies. Virgin's A3U 3D Neo acquisitions and Aer Lingus's initiatives to modernize its fleet align with broader industry trends toward carbon reduction as travelers increasingly demand eco-friendly options. Biofuel and Sustainable Practices Virgin has taken steps toward carbon reduction by integrating biofuel use and exploring sustainable aviation fuel SAF, partnerships. As the UK prepares to implement stricter carbon regulations, Virgin is working proactively to stay compliant. Challenges with rising costs. Higher fuel prices. Impacting profit margins. Rising fuel prices have put pressure on airline profitability. For both Aer Lingus and Virgin Atlantic, increased operational costs have affected their ability to maintain competitive pricing without sacrificing profit margins. Inflation and labor costs. Airlines face higher costs across the board, including labor expenses. 
This trend has impacted Aer Lingus, which recently had to negotiate new contracts with its workforce. Virgin has also faced similar challenges in maintaining service standards while managing costs, aiming for stronger customer experiences. Enhanced onboard experience. Virgin Atlantic's cabin upgrades on the A33neo aim to improve the passenger experience with modern interiors and comfortable seating arrangements. Virgin's efforts reflect the airline's commitment to staying competitive in a demanding market. Improved customer support at Aer Lingus. Aer Lingus is focusing on enhancing customer support to restore its reputation following recent operational disruptions. Enhanced digital support systems and quicker responses to delays are part of this strategy. These recent moves reflect both airlines' efforts to adapt to a rapidly evolving aviation landscape. While Aer Lingus addresses operational setbacks and Virgin Atlantic deepens its network partnerships, both are navigating the complexities of a highly competitive industry while committing to sustainability and passenger satisfaction. Hope you like this video. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.